guys, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a haul of many many different random items. I went shopping today. I just did a haul on my chlorine, the chlorine stuff that I got. So if you guys are interested, you can check it out in my hauls playlist down below in the description box. But what I'm going to show you now are basically like the other random items that I got that I have in this big tanks bag now. So I thought I'll just show it to you instead of putting it in the corner of my room collecting dust and not using it for a few weeks so if you guys are interested please stay tuned okay so the first place that I went to was my sort of nail supply store that I always go to in Far East Plaza um, the name of the place is Pan I think this is how the logo of it looks like it's on the fourth floor yeah it's on the fourth floor of Far East Plaza it's sort of like I don't know it's zero four <laughs> 04124 okay that's the unit number and that's where I get usually most of like my nail polishes and stuff like that so I got two things from there I got this uh, huge pedal brush because I just needed a new one and this was 1190 um, very very it feels like um, a proper brush like and also feels like a pedal you could actually whack and make someone cry with this but I'm going to use it for good use for my hair, so just to kind of blow dry my hair and stuff like that. And I always wanted to try a petal brush. I heard it's very really good to kind of get rid of tangles in your hair. Not that I have a lot, but I'm rambling on, so let's move on to the next item. Next item is the Mariah Carey Liquid Sand um, Collection. And they were selling this, I'm not sure how much they sell this um, in other places, but this was sold at $33.90 in the store. And I've actually always wanted to, I've been looking at this online for a few months now, but I just never got around to buying it. So um, it features all um, four different liquid scent uh, finishes. So you've got Get Your Number here, which is the blue one. Now let me just take it out and show you properly. Okay, so um, I didn't get these the first time when it came out because I wasn't sure how the liquid sand formula would work. So I got the red one which is the impossible and I tried it on, liked it and thought that it was actually quite unique. So I decided to get it. So I'll show you. So all these were actually named after the songs and my best friend Vincent would know because he's a huge Marakaya fan. So this one is very very nice. It's called Get Your Number. It's blue. So the Mariah, Carey, bleh, the Mariah Carey collection was basically the first ones that came up with the liquid sand formula and then all the other ones followed suit. So this one is Can't Let Go, which is like a purple one, very very pretty. And then this one I already have but it came with the collection so I might give it away to someone. It's very very cute, it's the impossible. To me out of all that, this one is actually the prettiest. So. If you're looking for it, go look for swatches for this for you to decide which ones you like the best. And then the last one is Stay the Night, which is sort of like a black base with a reddish sort of sparkles liquid on it. So they are very, very pretty. I saw this um, picture on um, a, a blog that I follow. It's called Ivana Things Pink or something. I will link it here. And she basically had swatches of this on her hands and I thought, I gotta get it. So burping a lot I don't know why so yeah that's that I'm very happy that I finally got my hands on it so yeah 3390 so each of it is about I don't know how much is 3390 divided by 4 my math is so bad my god I have to use my phone to calculate and you guys have to wait for me to calculate where some of you are probably like already have the answer by now 3390 divided by 4 is about $8.40 each. Um, it's a little bit pricey, but yeah, you get to try all of that. So, moving on to the next item. This I went to was Kiki, and it's basically a stationery store in Ion. I was served by this really, really fabulous Malay guy who was like very, very kind and he was kind of explaining to me all the different types of pens and stuff. So, I was like, okay. Thank you so much for your help. Uh, he was very, very sweet though. So I actually love the Kiki pens. I got mine um, the first time as a Christmas gift 
from uh, my friend Jinji and his fiance, and I really like it. So I like the gel pen. So I got it in this sh uh, sort of shade. It's very very cute. Little I'm not sure like what animals there. It's so freaking cute. I love it so much. This was like five ninety five, and they actually, um, it's like a gel pointed pen. Writes very very smoothly, so I highly recommend it. It's very very nice to write with. It actually has refill, so that's good to know. Thanks to the guy who was serving me. I didn't get his name. I'm so sorry. But if you're watching, hello. And um, this one is the metal rollerball pen, and it's slightly more expensive. Okay, that's the saying it has there, do what you love, love what you do. And I thought that it was very, very cute. And this is sort of like metallic, it's a lot heavier. And it has um, it has a lot more kind of, it's not a ballpoint pen. So it also comes with, uh, sorry, it doesn't come with, but it also has refills if you're interested in that. This was 1990, slightly more expensive, but I thought it would be nice for me to put it in my handbag. Okay, next item I got uh, is a set of five different candy colored pens and they're so freaking cute and it's actually for my upcoming project that I have. So this, ooh, these five pens were twelve ninety, and I actually got them because I'm having a get together with my bridal party and I want to give this to them as like a like a door gift kind of thing so I'm pairing these with like a notebooks that I got from Muji I'll show you them now so I went to Muji and I got these notebooks because you know if you're gonna be my bridesmaids you're gonna have to do stuff okay so I got these notebooks they're very very basic but very chic so I have five bridesmaids all together so this was I think only a dollar thirty cents so it's quite affordable and inside is basically lined so for them to I mean they can use it for whatever that they want but I just thought that you know it'll be cute so each person will basically be getting that and one of this pen and then I'm thinking of like customizing their names here for them so yeah. okay I'm gonna try to quicken up because my battery light is blinking I hate it when that happens okay I went to Sephora and then I got a couple of things from Mac um, the lady who was serving was very very nice everybody in Sephora is nice except for some people that I shall not mention here but yeah I don't like it when people are not friendly to me when I'm buying stuff from you you know anyway I got a blush and this is actually a blush that Nitra B, uh, who's a very famous YouTuber here, I'll link her thingy down below. Um, she actually loves this and she has got like darker skin than me but it shows up really really nicely on her so I thought it would be nice on me. So this is the blush called Melba. I'm sure you guys have heard about it. It's very very famous. In fact, I went to the one in Tanks and it was sold out. So it looks very very peachy, very creamy here. It looks like it might not actually show on my skin tone but it actually did. She did a swatch for me just now it was really really pretty so I decided to get that very very pretty it's a matte finish let me do a quick swatch that's how the swatch kind of looks like and swatching it on my hand anyway you guys can't see it but I love that so that's Malba and then the other thing that I got is something that I've been wanting to try I've tried alternatives of these but they just don't seem to meet the standard like they smell really weird but basically like a uh, face spritzer that I can just bring along with me in my purse and then spritz my face to kind of freshen up my makeup instead of putting on more makeup so I decided to get the max fix plus okay so this is a very very famous product that's how the packaging looks like very very pretty they have different types of like flavors or different types of uh, fix pluses that you can actually buy depending on the kind of lifestyle that you lead so they have one that's for outdoors one that's for indoors so this is like the basic one they do have one that's for indoors for people who are always in the air condition like office areas I did want to get that but I didn't like the smell of it I love this one so it's very very nice. I'll just, in fact, I want to spritz it right now. Might not be a good idea since I don't have much battery life left. <sighs> it feels so good. And it, there's not much of a smell but it just smells so good. So I'm actually thinking 
it's quite big for me to actually put it in my um, in my purse and she said that they didn't have like travel size I thought that they did but they didn't so I was thinking I'll put it probably on my desk at work and then whenever I want like to freshen up it actually feels like it wakes you up so when I want to like freshen up and stuff I can just spritz this and it looks very very chic as well but as I was checking out um, I actually saw this at the counter which is like a Sephora pump I'm not sure whether it will work for this but it comes with it's very very cute it comes with like a little funnel that looks, that like, looks that like that for you to pour your product in and then the tube itself looks like this so the lady the mac girl actually did recommend to me or oh, just get one of these and then you can use it to kind of spritz your face so that was a pretty good idea and i'm looking forward to kind of put this in my handbag and freshen up my makeup so the good thing is that okay so from what she told me this product is supposed to um, freshen up your makeup supposed to also make you a little bit more awake and also if you want to fix your makeup you can actually use this as well so it's a very multi-purpose kind of product and yeah I just like the idea of that so I got that and then very quickly before my camera dies um, in tanks I got my Bobbi Brown loose powder in warm natural and I was just running out of it and this is basically my favorite product of all time so I just had to show that to you guys I did a 30 day challenge thingy on Instagram and one of it was like your favorite product so this was my favorite product the sheer finish loose powder by Bobbi Brown I'm in warm natural so this is like my magic powder I have to have this so so yeah, that was my little uh, random -y haul that I got today. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you have any questions on any of the products, do let me know down below. Uh, click like to like this video and subscribe to subscribe to my channel. And then I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye. I'll get him to say bye to you too. Bye.